hello everyone Prozwal here and today in this tutorial I'll explain you some advanced ways that you can use to make your YouTube videos a bit faster actually I already have a video on this topic but that doesn't work anymore and in that video you can see the video if you want I'll leave the link for the video in the description below and in that video I talked about you to further better and actually what it was was it was a mode that allowed you to browse the videos or buffer the videos a bit faster than the normal speed by blocking the ads and blocking most of the unnecessary videos that you would see on the recommend recommendation sidebar so that doesn't work anymore and i'm getting lots of comments on that video that the method doesn't work so here's another video and this is some of the advanced ways that you can use to make a, your YouTube buffering a bit faster on your normal internet speed. So first of all, uh, let's get into the tutorial and the first thing I'm going to talk about is using command prompt. Using command prompt, we will block some certain IP addresses and these IP addresses are the CDN IP addresses and what this actually does is YouTube uses CDN networks to deliver its content to different countries and different countries have different CDN networks that they get the content from. So if you're in Australia, there's different CDN networks and if you're in the United States, there might be different CDN. The main thing is it depends on the video that which CDN network it's getting the video from. And most of the time the video is cast on the CDN network. So if you're accessing the video um, from the same country and someone else have already watched the video and it's on the CDN network, it's cast from the network's server, from the CDN server instead of YouTube server. So sometimes the CDN network might be down, it might be slow, so your videos might be buffering a bit slower than it actually should. So we're gonna block these IP addresses which will actually make YouTube uh, download or buffer the videos from YouTube server straight away instead of using the CD network. So first of all, depending on the version of Windows that you're using or depending on the operating system that you're using, it's going to be different. So if you're using Windows, it's going to be different. If you're using Mac OS operating system and if you're using Linux or Unix, it's going to be different. So the process is the same, just the code is going to be different. Here's a blog post that I've written on my blog on the same topic so you'll have to type in some commands into the command prompt I'm using Windows so I'm going to use this command if you're using Mac OS operating system you're going to have to use this process and if you're using Linux you're going to have to be using this process so I'm using Windows so I'm just going to copy this code and what you'll have to do is you'll have to open command prompt CMD and right click on that and click on run as administrator because if you do not run it uh, run it as administrator you're gonna you're not gonna be able to do it click on run as administrator click on yes and right click and paste the command and hit enter and you should see a message that says okay so it if it says okay you're all good to go after that close the command prompt and if you want you can disconnect the internet and reconnect it back so I'll just turn it off and turn it back on so I'm just gonna go I've reconnected my internet and open any video that I want that's us say Eminem so it should be a bit faster than before if it's not there's another way and I would I recommend you to go through this process first and block the CD and IP addresses before getting into another tutorial or the, another method. The another method is using your YouTube's advanced settings. Uh, back in days when YouTube just started, you were allowed or you were able to get into YouTube's advanced settings mode and change internal settings as well. And that's not allowed anymore, but there's a work workaround for that. You'll have to get Chrome for that. There's another, there's ways in Mozilla Firefox as well, but I'm using Chrome and it's 
I find it better and easy on Chrome. So I recommend you to use Chrome over Mozilla Firefox. So after you've installed Chrome, I'll leave the download link for extension or a plugin. It's a YouTube sender plugin. You can download it. After you've downloaded the plugin, just open up the Chrome, open the extensions, and then just drag the plugin and drop to install. Click on add. And as you can see, the YouTube sender has been added and enabled as well. So now go to YouTube, refresh it. As you can see, welcome to YouTube center. Click and go to settings. And as you can see, you have unlocked your advanced settings for YouTube. You can control everything you want for your YouTube player. Like watch videos, your layout, your player, everything autoplay resolution player size volume shortcuts and everything so i'm going to be talking about two things over here first thing is that just go to your center settings go to general uh go to actually sorry go to player and you should see your task playback over here what this actually is is nowadays youtube downloads the videos or buffers the videos in blocks instead of downloading it at a single time so if you enable it, it downloads the videos in small blocks and if you disable it and the YouTube downloads the videos all at a time in a single block. So disable that and it's saving. And another thing, it shows your player type. It's default and nowadays a google chrome and youtube forces all the users to use html5 for the videos so actually you can use flash and i'll show you why you should use flash click in flash and disable the dash playback and it should save in some seconds close that close your chrome restart your chrome go to youtube so as you can see you can see lots of stuffs going over here after you've installed the plugin you can see all the likes dislikes the video quality its frame rates per second and a preview as well before or without clicking on the video so that's really good and as you can see when you click on a video pause it and right click it it's playing via the HTML5 player so you want to change that for the next tutorial or the next method that allows you to buffer your videos a bit faster so click on this settings click on player disable the task playback and disable the HTML5 player and click on flash for that Give it a few seconds to save the settings and refresh your home page and open up another video. Pause that, right click on it, and as you can see, now it's playing via the Flash Player. It's using Flash Player to, to play the YouTube videos. So now, what you will do is right click on the video and click on settings. and you should see something like this it's a adobe plus player settings so click on this yellow icon over here and it's the cache memory or the local storage memory that the flash play is using to buffer the videos from youtube so you can increase that to unlimited and this allows the flash player or this gives the flash player maximum storage for the videos uh, buffering the video so take it all the way to the right until it says unlimited and then click and close and that's all so now after installing the plugin and blocking the IP addresses and in using flash player and increasing the cache memory on the local storage for flash player your YouTube should buffer or load a bit faster Hope this works.
and drop down comments and I'll try to help you guys. Thank you for being here and hope this helps. Thank you.